Monday, November 24th, and here's some of the news beyond the headlines. Shia Houthi rebels have driven al-Qaeda out of one of the group's remaining strongholds in central Yemen. Houthi fighters took control of al Baida province with the help of government forces. For weeks, they fought deadly battles with Sunni tribesmen backed by al-Qaeda affiliate Ansar al-Sharia. Some residents have welcomed the Houthi takeover, claiming life under the rebels is an improvement from one threatened by repeated U.S. drone strikes that targeted Sunni militants. Security forces in the West African nation of Togo dispersed a demonstration on Friday, organized by thousands of people calling for presidential term limits. Protesters threw stones at police, who blocked them from approaching a square in the capital Lomé, where they planned to hold the rally. Security forces responded with tear gas and rubber bullets. Term limits were removed from Togo's constitution in 2002. Earlier this year, the ruling party voted down a bill that would have reintroduced them. Demonstrators are urging the government to implement the proposal, which would force President Four Nassim Bey to step down next year. An outbreak of the plague has killed dozens of people on the African island nation of Madagascar over the past three months. The World Health Organization is warning the bacterial disease could rapidly spread in the capital Antananarivo and that the country's poor health care system isn't equipped to cope. The plague is carried by rodents and spread by fleas. If humans are bitten by infected fleas, they develop bubonic plague, which can be treated with antibiotics, which aren't widely available in the country. If the bacteria reaches the lungs and turns into pneumonic plague, it can kill people within 24 hours. The Crimean Peninsula is facing a foreign invader, but it's probably not what you think. Fishermen have caught deadly Japanese pufferfish in Sevastopol Bay, causing scientists to scratch their heads over how the tropical creature ended up there. The organs of the pufferfish, or fugu, are filled with poison deadlier than cyanide, and its liver contains enough toxin to kill five men. Pufferfish are a delicacy in Japan, but chefs need a special license to prepare and serve it. Researchers in Crimea say the fish pose a threat to the wildlife of the Black Sea and to the local population. Check out the Vice News YouTube channel for more original reporting and documentaries from around the world. I just want to get out of here.